Hey everybody, I'm at Radar Studios with owner, photographer, videographer, video producer, novelist, Brian D. Garrity. And he's in the zone right now. You don't bother Brian when he's in the zone. There's life out there on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> and it sounds like a cartoon. It looks like a cartoon. <laughs> oh, you're me, you're <laughs> so, God. just starting to put the UV lighting in there. Oh, that looks good on camera. Oh, that does look really cool. Good. Wow. Ah. Oh, because you get the blue line down here that you can't really see. That's though. right. Isn't that cool? So I hadn't even noticed that before, but still working cool. on not done yet. Just to start, right, Eva? It's just to start. Eva, come over here into the light. Come into the light. Come here. Yeah. What's up? So these fans will be illuminated, um, and there'll be Boy, more light in really the room. Really good on the camera. Yeah, cannons have um, really good low light, and you're going to get a new cannon. Hopefully. Yes. <laughs> and what's the first thing you want to shoot with a new cannon, Brian? No, it's porn. <laughs> <laughs> so right now it looks like Brian's diffusing light. Flagging light. Flagging light. Is it because of um, the light reflecting off the window on the side? You're trying to... No, I'm just trying to direct the spill from the main light so it's not bouncing around and polluting the other lights. I don't think I've seen it running yet. I did that one. We do good work. That is actually pretty quiet. Then it was a time we had all the bends done and then it was just, okay, getting the size right. That's where we spend most of the time, sanding and cutting. Not in that order, though. True, cutting and sanding. Cutting again, sanding again. Well, I like to sand before I cut. <laughs> <laughs> nice clean edge to cut <laughs> off that way. <laughs> we made a custom th threaded barb for the reservoir, and uh, there's a uh, G quarter connector going into that, so there's a hose from the fill port now into the top of the reservoir. Oh yeah. With a 90 degree? Yep. Yep. So, uh, I did that on Sunday. Oh, and you then made filled it up again. I drained it. I What I did to drain it is I um, put a hose on top of the res and just took the whole thing and tipped it over, tipped it over to bucket and uh, and filled it back up again. It's distilled water and Mayhem's UV green dye. Uh, let's see here. Yep. The UV green dye. Yeah. Oh, let me turn the light off so you can see it cool. I like the mix of the UV. Yeah, that looks cool, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, like the UV green here and then the green light on the motherboard is almost the same exact color. Yeah. So here you can see the UV LED 
projectors and there is four of them and they put off a pretty intense amount of light. By the way, you reminded me. I've still got extra parts left over from this project that I grabbed from MMPC Tech on the first day that we did this with the Mod Zoo. And I'm giving you, the viewer, supporter and subscriber of my channel, the opportunity to win this stuff. Notice in the title of the video I didn't put giveaway or make any public announcement about it. I wanted you only to see it, the people that watch the videos. So this is what I have. Brand new Nautilus 240 Overkill Grill. You can use this on either a radiator or fans. Copper PC pop rivets for your chassis. Fighter pilot switch with a clear cover. And the new white Delrin case feet from MMPC Tech. All this stuff is new. Couple of the UV green fan blade, 120 millimeter LED fans. These are brand new and uh, reactor symbol fan grills. We were gonna put these on the top and we decided to cannibalize the 900D mesh instead. So how do you win this stuff? All you have to do is like the video and thank you for everybody that likes my videos. It's always encouraging, yes. And uh, share the link either on your Facebook wall or on Twitter or Google Plus whichever social media you prefer. But most importantly, I want you to leave a comment as to why you should get this stuff for your current project, a future project, or even a friend's project. You can share this stuff with a friend. And I'll choose a winner on January 22nd. I'll post their name here as a comment. And grab my attention with something creative. I'd like to read the comments, so. Oh, and this is open to all people around the world because MMPC Tech ships overseas all the time. So it doesn't matter where you are, even if you're on some remote island I've never heard of before. So that's your assignment if you want to win this stuff. And I look forward to seeing the comments. And uh, good luck.